I was hoping to get this card, but I, I don't know if that's gonna happen now. Looking at just what I have accomplished, I I'm not even halfway there, I don't think. But oh my, I have mixed feelings about this card. My main issue is the vision, look at that. 86 is not bad, but that is, that's just not gonna cut it, I don't think. For all the shit you have to get to get this card. I don't know, I, I, I don't know. I don't know if it's worth getting. Might as well just wait until they release Willie Mays, because I'd rather have him anyways. But let's be honest here, Willie Mays is probably going to be a World Series reward, and everyone knows my ass ain't making World Series. Not a chance in hell. I'm not about to drop 200,000 stubs on Willie Mays. Okay, maybe. Well, I was hoping to be able to get that Mike Trout, but since that isn't happening, I don't really have anything going on today. So this is what we have going on. We're not going to be debuting anyone today or nothing. We're not going to put ourselves under the stress of playing BR either. I've had enough of all that shit. So instead, today we're just going to be playing some old-fashioned baseball with the team. All we've been doing is debuts and BR. Getting a little sick of that shit, if I'm being honest. So we're gonna just kinda kick back and relax and try to win us a game. Hopefully it goes well too. The last thing I need is this pitching to give up bombs and then the offense to not show up. Same thing with the defense. If there's errors everywhere, I'm just gonna start breaking shit. I don't wanna do that. I just wanna relax and play some baseball. Can't see my TV, but I got the Reds game going on and they're currently losing. So I am gonna be watching that on and off during this episode. If you got a problem with that, you can simply eat shit. Hell, I just took a fireball shot, too. This is an interesting team. He's got Lefty Grove pitching. I have yet to face Lefty. Brett Saberhagen! The Sabertooth Tiger is walking to the mound. Hell, I've been hyping this dude up so much about his hitting skills, and I've yet to show him besides that one game. But hopefully this dude doesn't quit after just two innings. He might, because he's batting 56 with Corey Seager. It's every time I record. Every time. What is this dude, one for 18 with Corey Seager? Now one for 19. He's somehow batting 300 with Jimmy Rollins, though. Get his ass out with this off-speed pitch. All right, come on, Jackie, run. Nice play. All right, this inning honestly defies whether or not he quits. Hell, we didn't even get the bat yet. Hell, dude, I might just pitch with Brett Saberhagen every single time. Seems every time we pitch with him, everyone quits. Oh, we're facing the Cincinnati Bengals. All right. Chances are he might lead this whole game and then end up blowing it in the ninth. Duke with a drive up the middle, that's gonna be caught. I hate playing at Coors Field. The elevation is 500,000 feet, but I can't seem to hit the ball here. Come on, Jackie can beat this out, easily. All right, that's where the wheels pay off, kids. Come on, Larry, whip out your pecker and smack a home run. Or just pop up. See, I said I was gonna relax and I'm already tensing up. Especially since Hogan is batting now and he hasn't done anything as of late. He's got you 2-0 right now. Wait for your pitch. All right, way to hold it up. 3-0, you better throw Hogan something, you jackass. He did, and Hogan will crash it. Hit a mile into the air, into the bullpens. Hell yeah, oh, look at that quick little high five. Oh, Davis didn't follow through with it. Back to back, maybe? Come on, travel, come on. Anus! Alright, Brett, show him your skills. Dude, I always talk shit about Nick Magdurall, and he just eats my ass up. Always call him a short little bastard, and then he's pimping home runs. You know, it feels nice starting off with a lead. Something I usually don't do. Thanks to Hogan, we're up 2 nothing. Hopefully Saberhagen can keep it up. He's only faced two batters, but if he can get outs at this rate, we'll do fine. Who knows, this dude might quit too. Everyone quits when Saberhagen's on the hill. I wouldn't want to face Brett Saberhagen either. The Sabertooth Tiger! The Bengals Tigers versus the Sabertooth Tigers. Snap this slider in there. Alright, Jackie. You cover ground well. Tori has slowed down just a bit. That's gonna be a flyout. I had some pre-workout too, so my ass is just itching. Ready to run through a wall. I could headbutt a brick wall and I'd feel no pain right now. Come on, fastballs and cutters. Any Anything down the middle to many is nothing. It's like a four-year-old swinging a pool noodle. Chattered the damn bat. What was it, one for four last game with Edwin? I mean, at least you didn't go hitless. But this is not a very good start for Edwin. We need to hurry up and get Stan on the team. I would love to have Mike Trout in center field, but no, that ain't gonna happen. I ain't got the time to just try to collect him. Plus, I'd probably grind for weeks to try to get him, and then when I finally get him, he plays like shit. I'll have fucking 30 at-bats with Mike Trout, and he'll probably be 3 for 30. Son of a 
Bitch, the Reds are giving up more runs. About to go one and four today. At least the Blue Sox are on a winning streak. Wait, no, we're not on a winning streak. What am, what am I talking about? We lost last game. At least we have a winning record. There, that, that sounds better. All right, full count, two outs. Sit this man down. Or freeze him with a hanging slider right over the middle of the plate. But look at this. Brett Saberhagen gets to come to the bat and look at that batting average. Oh my, that kind of looked pitiful. Brett! This man is a hitting machine. Are you fucking serious? He has more hits than Edwin. Oh, come on, Duke. You can at least run and try to not turn two. All right, I am telling you guys what. If you do not have Brett Saberhagen, go pick him up. Piss on Otani, piss on Brendan McKay or whatever his cocksucking name is. You want a pitcher slash hitter, go get Brett Saberhagen. How in the hell? Larry, get down! That's getting down, everybody run! Jackie, run! Alright, just walk on in there. Don't worry about the tag, he won't tag you. Alright, Hogan, you can really break this game wide open. Oh my! He threw that same pitch that you homered on last time. Luber is a dumbass, though. Come on, get up the middle! Damn it! I'm honestly okay with that. If Hogan went deep again and it was 6-0, this dude probably quits. And I don't like playing three ranked season games in a row. Especially since, like, what's the chances I'm gonna get on a three-game win streak? Can't even do that in BR. How am I gonna do that in ranked seasons? Slowly but surely, I think Brett Saberhagen might be the ace of this squad. Alright. Deals on the mound, and then when he gets in the box, it's hits galore. Sit Kluber down. All right, I did promise Davis that I was gonna get him Balenciaga cleats. Maybe they can have a collab with Supreme. You'll get that present if you just continue to do well. That's not very well. A strikeout on a fastball down the middle. Another jam shot from Tory. That might fall. All right, many don't let us go down hitless in this inning. All right, with a piss poor swing like that, it's not looking good. The offense will wake up next inning because Saberhagen's coming to hit. Start printing off Sabertooth Tiger t-shirts and selling them at the porch. We'll have a picture of Brett Saberhagen foaming out of the mouth with his big old tiger teeth. Falls on his hands, scratching his opponent's eyes out. That's a million dollar t-shirt right there. Oh, damn it. There goes the perfect game. Oh, who really gives a damn? As long as he wins this game, I'm fine with it. Saberhagen has the utmost confidence right now. He is dotting every single pitch. Turn two, Edwin, come on! Oh wait, there's two outs. See what you can do here, Edwin. You could have just tagged first, but you know. You had to make it a little bit more difficult, didn't you? Oh shit, hold on. I just realized my face cam's covering the scoreboard. My bad. Hell, maybe it's the mixture of fireball, creatine, pre-workout, and coffee. Making me sound like a dumbass. What in the hell? Where's this ball going? Nobody's coming third! Why didn't you run? Nobody was covering third. No way! Are you kidding me? Brett Saberhagen, are you kidding me? There's all the proof you need, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my. Look at this shit. Five at-bats, five hits, two doubles, one home run, and five RBI. His hitting stats are not even that good. That was, well, that was fun. I feel like a complete ass by covering the scoreboard almost the whole game with my face cam. I'm sorry about that. Brett Saberhagen is the ace of this squad. I mean, look at the innings pitch. It's only 13, but he has five wins with a 1.3 ERA, 18 strikeouts. This man is a machine. I don't know. I think we can make a push towards division series now. Once we get there, then then we'll start discussing where we go from there. Championship series, World Series. I highly doubt it. But yeah, I mean, we're, we're making everyone quit. This pitch with Bryce Saberhagen, I don't care if he's gassed. We'll march to the World Series then. Well, I think that completes our video. Hopefully next time I play, we can get a full nine inning game. As of late, I've not been able to get any complete games done because everyone is quitting. Getting kind of late and I kind of want to finish watching this Reds ball game that they're probably going to lose. Yeah, losing 4-2 in the six right now. About to go 1-4 on the season.